Hello everyone, I will come back to the Emo Events video because today we have got new events uh, Slightly shorter ones because this is a mid update events because the major update is usually every two weeks So we got an update last week this time we got some smaller events But actually pretty good even though they are like short They are still pretty good events and the first thing is the seal exchange event from Hikari we will be able to buy a whole bunch of seals using seal exchange ticket and here is the full list of all the seals you can buy at their price what stat they give and yeah everything you need to know now of course that comes with the seal exchange package in the cash shop costing 100, 198 crown which will include 250 seal openers and 3000 seal exchange tickets so this, are, this is usually the best item to buy I think and yeah it have a whole bunch of seals so yeah this event will end on the 10th of January alongside the NPC and the package will be removed from the cash shop next up is double ticket event and half stats event now both will end on the 10th of January as well and yeah the first one is that these dungeons on your screen right now will give you double amount of tickets so yeah here you can see my Ujusmon will give me 4 instead of 2 so during the event period these dungeons will give you double the tickets that they normally give you per day which is pretty cool additionally these dungeons are gonna be half stats the bosses inside of the dungeon will be half their HP half their attack and half their defense so yeah these dungeons are now gonna be much easier for the next week which is pretty cool again this is a shorter one but still pretty good this is i think the second time we get this event and i really hope it becomes a tradition that we get this event every now and then because it's pretty cool it makes getting the true device much easier since we'll be able to get more passes and do the dungeons easier and yeah let's move on to the last thing which is some bug fixes but the big I mean it's one bug fix but the big thing here is the announcement of the jumping event so yeah jumping event in the Kore at least in the Korean website in the Korean game will happen on January 4th which after actually tomorrow we'll probably get this event probably next week in the English version or maybe longer I don't know usually we get the events very close and actually for some reason in, in Kenimo they did not get the Abyss event like it was not announced I don't think it happened unless I missed it so that's a bit weird that they did not get an event usually we are the ones that are behind so I'm not sure about that but jumping event is something that will happen in the Korean version and we will be getting one very soon so yeah it's very small update really but just a whole bunch of cool events and announcement of jumping event so basically good news I would say good vibes <laughs> And uh, yeah, with that, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like on it and subscribe for more demo content. And I will see you all in the next video.